Adair made some chocolate brownies and decided to take some into the woods to give as a gift to the fairies. I know how much they like sweet things, so I thought this would be a nice treat for them. I wrapped up the pieces of brownie and took them to a place in the woods where I thought I might find a fairy door. Sure enough, I found one in the undergrowth. I left the wrapped up brownies there and waited to see what would happen. Later, when I came back, the brownie pieces had gone. And when I looked under some moss, I found a little fairy note. written in the fairy language, so I'll need to translate it. Back home, I used my fairy cipher decoder to work out what was written on the note. And here it is. It's a recipe for nettle cake. So I've decided to try it out. I've got my gloves on and I'm going to pick some nettles. I've never used nettles in cooking before, but apparently they're very good for you. Usually people use nettles in things like soups or salads. So a nettle cake is quite unusual, but I love baking, so I'm gonna give it a go. I think I've collected enough nettles now, so I'll go back home and start baking. First thing is to wash the nettles. Now I'm pouring boiling water on them, and I'm going to boil them for five minutes The next thing is to blend them up. And here's what they look like. So now I'm following that recipe and putting in flour. Sugar. Butter. and lemon zest. And a couple of teaspoons of baking powder. Once that's blended, I'm now gonna add in the milk. And now some eggs. Finally, the nettles go in. And now I'm putting the mixture into cupcake cases. I cannot wait to taste this fairy recipe. I wonder if the fairies are playing a trick on me. Hopefully not. We'll see. Now the cakes can go into a low oven for about 25 minutes. And look at that, they're done. And they look pretty good. Let's 
let's see what it looks like inside. It looks pretty good. Look at that green colour. I decided to decorate some of them with a lemon buttercream icing. And they taste delicious. I'm really pleased with my fairy recipe. I'm going to put the recipe on my Instagram page so you can all make it too.